guys welcome back to my youtube as you guys can tell i'm in the middle of my makeup so this is going to be like a get ready with me hotel review vlog i actually have no idea the direction of this video but as you guys know and you guys can see by the title of the video i am in oh my god by the way i'm running late for my checkout in this hotel i'm low-key scared that the staff is gonna knock at my door and like yell at me because french people are Paris Eiffel Tower Hotel. How I found this hotel was through a friend that I follow on Instagram. Shout out to her. She um, posted a photo of her in this hotel. I loved the view and I was like, sis, what hotel is this? Like, So I pulled up. <laughs> what am I even saying? I'm literally like the worst multitasker, so bear with me. So I, I, I booked a hotel and let me tell you, it was $400 for one night to be exact. $398 dollars for one night and let me just tell you that is overpriced for what i am getting well i'm gonna get to it so i need to say that i am coming here in a high season meaning that it is um new year's eve so people are going to most likely want to book right now and hotels are most likely going to charge you an arm and a leg to just stay at a hotel i'm sure you guys are gonna pay like half the price coming off season so definitely consider that oh my god guys i suck at multitasking was this a good idea oh my god was this a good idea to do this okay who's off so um i checked out a little bit of the amenities of the hotel but not really so i'm going to go check out the amenities again and i'm going to be showing it to you guys so that we can see like okay where else is our money going like okay so we can see if it's worth it but from what i've seen so far the lobby is very elegant it's very beautiful like it definitely does look like sherry okay, so here's the lobby this is the lobby i don't want to like film people but here's the lobby check out i think over there is like where people have like their breakfast i didn't have breakfast today morning because i woke up late but yeah so here's like the waiting room but now let's talk about the room because that's really where you're going to be staying at right uh the room is really nice i'm not gonna lie it's nice but it's not like four hundred dollars for the night you know exclude the view the view is definitely worth that four hundred dollars um well is it i don't know but like Can you guys hear the ambulance? I actually asked the hotel, I was like, yo, do you guys have an amenities that shows the Eiffel Tower in the hotel that I can go check it out? And he was like, yeah, we do. We have it on the 10th floor, but it's closed because we use it for conference or whatever for dinner. I forgot what he said. He said it was closed for some reasons, but he's like, come back later and ask me about it and I will see like what I can do. There's a random lash in this brush, um, ignore that. <laughs> so kind to let me up here it's going to be open this area in february yeah around february this area is See the building over there. So nice. I'm gonna try to take a photo. I'm so happy to meet you guys. Wait. And then here's like the area. This is a bar. So they have a bar here. And then I guess you can have your drinks. Such a vibe at night.
I don't even be drinking coffee like that. That's why I'm like, I think I'm kind of, oh, I was gonna say I'm done with my makeup, but girl didn't even put them on, on mascara. So what was I gonna say? What was I gonna say? I was gonna say, yeah, so if you get to get a view from the Eiffel Tower, from like the amenities of the hotel, then I think it'll be worth it because it's like, yay, like your money's going into a different location that you guys can experience the Eiffel Tower view from more of a private place because Paris is very touristy. So there's gonna be a lot of people around the Eiffel Tower and like outside the streets. So if you wanna have more of a private, intimate experience with the Eiffel Tower, intimate, I don't know what the hell that even means intimate experience with the Eiffel Tower, then a hotel would definitely be that. If you guys are traveling with a friend, I don't necessarily recommend this hotel unless you guys really want to take pictures and it makes financially sense for you guys, then sure, go do it. Like, you know, when you got money, the world is your oyster. <laughs> um, have a friend, I honestly would recommend just staying in a different hotel in the city that's more affordable and then just like spending the day exploring paris it's a traveling solo i do recommend this hotel because if especially if you're a content creator and you want to take photos by the eiffel tower i recommend this hotel because i'm gonna tell you it's busy out in the streets and if you want to take photos with the eiffel tower it's not as easy I didn't want to risk taking my tripod out in these streets and then somebody snatching it away from me and running away with my phone because that could really happen, you guys. I'm, I always think three, four, five times ahead and that's why, like, I always tell people to not worry about me traveling because, trust me, I am very, very conscious about my surroundings and I really, like, don't do stupid shit. So if I do stupid shit, it's in a very smart way. Like stupid shit like going out partying by myself here in Paris without knowing anybody there. So that was kind of stupid, but not really because I did it safely and I did it smartly. So anyways, that's besides the point. And if you were with your boyfriend or your boo thing, I do recommend this place because I think you can um, ask to have breakfast in the balcony. There's like chairs outside so you can really like eat out in the balcony and have a really nice experience with the eiffel tower view so i definitely highly recommend it for couples and solo people with friends i don't think it's 100 percent worth it why am i acting like i'm done with my makeup like bruh like i'm just out here acting like i'm done with my makeup and i didn't even put on lipstick like i literally was about to like end this video oh hell no let me brush my teeth real quick because am i the only one that like does her makeup and then brushes their teeth and brushes their lip and then puts on lipstick let me put on my lipstick my lip gloss actually so yeah you guys i'm gonna show you guys the view um i really like the fact that they have a really nice desk area and i'm gonna remind you guys please go ahead and subscribe and like this video if you guys enjoyed this it really helps my channel you guys know i'm like a newbie here on youtube so it will mean the world if you guys can just try to push my content out there by liking subscribing and commenting and engaging with me if you guys have any questions about the hotel whatsoever ask down below i will answer your questions to the best of my ability no, no, you'll never leave.